My name is Riley Saunders. I'm a village idiot. Thank you so much for joining us. This is a show called Live at the Roslyn. It's a show we dreamed up where you can watch bands play from the comfort of your own home on Facebook Live and on YouTube. Make sure that you check out all the past videos that we've done. There's been about 79 episodes. You can find them on the playlist tab of Facebook uh, or just go subscribe to our YouTube channel and check them all out. Uh, this is an interactive rock show. Please click like and please click share. Uh, if That's the biggest support you can give if you want to compliment the artists that we have coming up here. And if you want to compliment and make sure that this thing keeps rolling, that's what we need you to do. We're also going to read out some comments in between the songs. So if you have questions or anything, make sure you let us know. Uh, as always, we got to give a shout out to the King's Head Pub. They are an extension of your living room. They're our head partner here for Live at the Roslyn. We love those guys and they love music. Make sure you check them out every single Friday. Friday and Saturday, they always got different bands playing, and uh, we love those guys, and they always give the best service. Anyway, we're going to kick it to the theme song, and then right after that, we have Rich O'Coin. Thanks, everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, we bring to you Rich O'Coin. Bring out your dates. Bring out your dates. Here's one. Ninepence. I'm not dead. What? Nothing. Here's your ninepence. I'm not dead. Here. He says he's not dead. Yes, he is. I'm not. He isn't? Well, he will be soon. He's very ill. I'm getting better. No, you're not. You'll be stone dead in a moment. Oh, I can't take him like that. It's against regulations. I don't want to go over the car. Oh, don't be such a baby. I can't take him. I feel fine.
lives so fast. What's the point? What do you mean? What does our life mean? What life? Do you know the story of Sisyphus? Who? Sisyphus. It's a myth about this guy who had to roll and push this incredibly huge rock, this very steep mountain. Every time he get to the top of the mountain, the rock would roll down again. And he, he would watch this, and he'd, he'd walk back down the mountain, and he'd do it all over again, forever. Drag. It's a metaphor for life, Leo. It's famous. <laughs> Everybody watching at home, <laughs> thank you very much for joining us. You are watching Rich O'Coin. He's here all the way from Halifax, Nova Scotia. Rich, how you doing, man? Great. Thanks so much for having me in your sweet living room. For sure. Thanks so much for being here. And I mean, you're not just here in Winnipeg to do Live at the Roslyn. Tell us about the show you have going on tomorrow night that people I, can come see. I would have come just for this, but <laughs> I am apparently playing a show also tomorrow night at the Goodwill. So if you're in the Winnipeg area, 
or if you want to drive uh, a million hours on your bike or <laughs> on a car, come, come to Winnipeg. And you know something about driving a many kilometers on your bike, but we're going to talk a bit more about that in a little bit. Uh, tomorrow he is playing with Sophie Stevens Band along with Sports Club, two local Winnipeg favorites that make sure everyone goes check them out. We should probably give away some tickets to that show, right, Rich? I might be putting you on the spot here. I, th I, think, I think we talked about that before, and we're oh, totally going to do that. Wait, <laughs> you're, not supposed to, you're not supposed to tell everybody that. <laughs> I was thinking it would be. I just like being real yeah. with you right now. We're in the we're in the safety living room right now. Yeah, I was thinking it would be super funny if I, if if I did that. Like, so, and we're gonna give away a T-shirt by Rich O'Coin here, and it's like, no, no, we're not actually. <laughs> We're not going to do that. <laughs> anyway, of course, we didn't Those talk about that. are all mine. <laughs> we always give away <laughs> tickets every Live at the Roslyn, but it's going to go to someone who shares. Please click like and please click share. We're going to give away three sets. Three sets screen? of two tickets share. tomorrow mm -hmm. at the Goodwill. Mm -hmm. I think it's... Yep, you had it right mm -hmm. there. Somewhere. <laughs> And Make we're going to need you to do that. And that's the biggest compliment we'll that you can give. Post. We'll add in post. <laughs> we want to give a quick shout out right now to a special, actually, uh, you know, a, a sponsor that's been with us for a long time. But they have a brand new special beer out. It's Torque Brewing. Everyone in the room is drinking Torque. How's everyone liking that? Even the people who didn't drink are cheering right now, so that's pretty sweet too. But anyway, they have a brand new beer that's uh, out at the West End Cultural Center. It's called Don't Fret, and it's actually out in stores as well. Proce a lot of proceeds from that is going to go towards the West End Cultural Center. And uh, they have a quote on the side of it from Mitch Podolak, who says, The West End Cultural Center is about making sure that people can get involved in the arts, music, and culture with their heart, brains, and guts. So shout out to Mitch Podolak, who uh, founded the West End Cultural Center and Winnipeg Folk Fest. We love them. And we also got to give a shout out to McNaught Cadillac Buick GMC. They're proud supporters of the Winnipeg music community and live at the Roslyn. We love those guys and uh, make sure that you support the people. If when you need to buy a car, go support the people that are supporting our community. Anyway, we're going to read some of your comments uh, after the next song, but I know you just want to hear more from Rich O'Coin. Take it away. So we are living as it were on many, many levels of rhythm. This is the nature of change. If you resist it, you have frustration and suffering. But on the other hand, if you understand change, you don't cling to it, and you let it flow, then it's no problem, it becomes positively beautiful.
Thanks so much. much. <laughs> Everybody, you are watching Rich O'Coin live with the Roslyn. He is here all the way from Halifax, and we're super stoked that you're here with us. And uh, he's playing at the Goodwill Social Club tomorrow night. Make sure you go check him out. We're giving away three sets of two tickets to someone who shares. So we need you to share right now, right, Rich? Share right now, over here, <laughs> right there, right so there. So please share and just do it for the love of that. We're going to make sure that you get contacted tomorrow and we're going to give away three pairs of tickets to that. So make sure you do that. Shane Marcus says he's tuning in all the way from Mexico. And we have Hello. Lindsay, Ma Lindsay Mazurkowicz is watching all the way from Palm Springs right now. Oh, so much warmer than here. <laughs> and if we have anybody else watching from out of town, let us know in the comments. We'll give you a quick shout out. Angie Lamaran says, oh, hey, pals. And hi, Jane Puchniak. Shout out to Jane Puchniak. <laughs> Woo, Jane. She is Jane, actually the Jane, one. Jane. Jed, Jed, Jed. <laughs> She's the one who set this all up and had Rich uh, play live with the Rosin, so we're super stoked to have her here. And uh, a lot of people are shouting her out. Heather Goosen says, So wild. Was debating on whether or not to go to the show tomorrow, but I was sold right away. That would actually be funny if she was like, I was debating whether or not to go to the show tomorrow, but no hell dice. no, yeah. <laughs> no dice. And I just kept reading it, like, yeah. you know, like an anchor man. You're he like, just... I, I didn't read past this first part of So Wild. Yeah. I bet this one's going to be good. Yeah, this So Wild. I can't believe how awful this guy is. <laughs> like an anchor man, yeah, he just reads whatever's on the prompter. Uh, Ian Graves says, you don't attend a Rich O'Coin show. You take part in one. Yeah, we were debating whether tonight to do it the way I do during the live show, which is like, I teach everyone the, the courses, and rather than me just kind of croon by myself up here, everyone just shouts the shit out of it. You can, I can swear, right? I, oh, yeah, yeah, cool. yeah right, you cool. know. <laughs> I mean, if you wanted this to be taken off the internet and never hear, seen again forever. The word swear. shit is not yeah. allowed <laughs> no, shit's on the all right. internet. Never seen well, it we there. can chant, though. Make sure you let us chant. Everyone in the room will chant. Everyone, you going to chant? <laughs> And we're going to have everybody at home chanting, but feel free if you want to throw that in. And uh, I just wanted to ask you, what's, you, you released a brand new album in May. Tell us a little bit about that album. Yeah. Uh, well, it's uh, called Release, uh, so that's confusing right there. Uh, all of my publicists uh, find it amazing to release a release called Release. Um, and uh, originally it was going to be called Death, but then I thought that might be a little too dark, so let's dial it back one and do a release instead. And uh, the record's all about uh, kind of those questions of like how we view existence and how we uh, deal with our terror management theory of, um, you know, just that existential angst of knowing our own mortality. That got heavy. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it also syncs up to uh, Alice in Wonderland, why I'm wearing this shirt. And uh, so if you like those like old uh, Pink Floyd synced up with the Wizard of Oz, you can press play at the same time, and they'll both run perfectly in sync with one another. And I basically watched it like a million times like a film composer and just uh, made like notes of like tempo and feel for every song. And then all the like lyrics correspond to what's happening on the screen. But then also trying to make that fit as a song on its own if you don't know that that's part of it. <laughs> that's amazing. And you've done that with multiple albums before, yeah, so right? Yeah, I've done that with all my albums, yeah. yeah. So, like, the first one was with How the Grinch Stole Christmas, and then I got a Cease and Desist from Dr. Seuss Enterprises <laughs> LP. Uh, and then the second one, I tried to do it with a public domain film, but I couldn't find one that, like, was as good as The Grinch. So uh, I cut together, like, 35 films that were in the public domain, and... It's everything from like It's a Wonderful Life to Night of the Living Dead, and uh, and then after that one, I did uh, I was was now fine to go back into copyrighted territory and did uh, uh, The Little Prince, this like old claymation version from the 1970s, and now we're we're here at uh, Alice in Wonderland. Right on. Well, tell yeah. us what you're gonna play next and take it from here. I think I'm gonna play a little ditty called The Self. And it's all about uh, questioning whether we actually exist or whether uh, the experience of life is just an experience like any other sense that we have, like smell or taste, and that the idea of our ego is just uh, an illusion. There we go. <laughs> the self is consciousness. But of course, that does not mean consciousness in the sense of our ordinary, everyday consciousness. The way your heart beats, the way you breathe, you're doing it. 
but you don't know how it's done. So therefore, just in the same way that conscious attention is not aware of all the other operations of the body, so in just that way, we are not aware of our connection, indeed our identity, with the fundamental self. You're joining us here for Rich O'Coin live at the Roslyn. Is everyone in the room having a good time? And I hope you at home are having a great time as well. Throw some hearts across the screen if you're enjoying Rich O'Coin. And make sure you check them out tomorrow night at the Goodwill Social Club, playing with Sophie Stevens Band and Sports Club. It's going to be an amazing time. Rich, for a lot of the people who don't know you, yeah. uh, tell us a little bit about your history in music. When did you get your start? And uh, how did you grow to be the artist that you are? <laughs> Uh, uh, well, well uh, I, guess I guess I started, I started off, off uh, with, with... I'm going to take that off on my voice. Uh, I started off, I guess I made a record by myself because I didn't think uh, I was just kind of doing it for fun. I'd already uh, gone across Canada like playing my brother's band, uh, playing like drums and 
vibraphone and synth. Um, and, and then I was like, okay, this is fun. I want to do this again, but I want to do it real slow. So I did it on a bicycle, <laughs> and I went out to Victoria and then biked back to Halifax. And, uh, and at, the po at that point, I kind of like played shows like this uh, where like everyone was seated and kind of uh, just like watching me. And I kind of wouldn't even be here. I'd be like over here performing, <laughs> and then there would be a big screen with How the Grinch Stole Christmas, and, and people would basically watch that. And then the second record, I decided I was going to like make it with a bunch of people. So I made it with like 500 people. And I again went across the country and did a bunch of half marathons uh, and recorded in like most of the major cities across Canada, including Winnipeg here. And, uh, and then that record turned into like what the kind of show evolved into, which is a big like uh, revival, like sing along dance party so I teach everyone uh, all the song like the lyrics before um, the song starts and then there's like a big projection screen with the lyrics just huge in case you've forgotten the uh, <laughs> instruction and and then there's just like lots of confetti flying there's a parachute that covers the audience and uh, usually I have a band with me I've got about 30 different band members <laughs> who all live in different cities, and then they just come to different shows uh, when it makes sense. So your live show is a bit of a party, so tomorrow at the Goodwill, yeah. they should be ready to party. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, uh, instead of couches in a living room, it'll be standing and sweating in a big old venue. <laughs> right on. Who would you say your biggest influences have been in your life for, uh, for music? Uh, I don't know, like... Uh, like Brian Wilson and the Flaming Lips and Air and uh, Beatles, like listen to a lot of Beatles. There was five CD or four CDs in the car growing up that were also like surprising <laughs> influences because I don't think you could tell from my music, but like a lot of Bob Dylan, uh, ABBA and uh, Leonard Cohen and Paul Simon. Right on. Yeah. Well, uh, we are hearing tunes from your brand new album. And uh, where can we find all your new tunes? Uh, on streaming platforms and everything, of course? On anywhere streaming happens. Check yeah. out the internet. Check out your local river. Uh, you can find <laughs> it. Uh, sometimes I just send CDs down the river. Uh, and I hope that someone finds and listens to it. And it's not too damaged. Right on. Everybody, please click like. Please click share. We're going to give more. Uh, we're going to have more. We're going to give more of Richo Coin. We're going to give coin. more. We're gonna, gonna actually, give we're going to give away more coin. tickets. That's my job. There we go. We're going to take more from Richo <laughs> Coin right now. Do you believe, 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 What is he doing? He's beginning to believe. You so badly want to believe. Ha ha, found what I needed.
believer, that's for sure right now. <laughs> Everybody, please click like, please click share. You are watching Rich O'Coin live at the Roslyn. We still have a bunch of tunes ready to go, but I'm going to read out some comments from people at home. Tim Green says, singing and dancing in Victoria. Thanks for watching, Tim. Lisa Lane hey, from Tim. Tim. Lisa Lane from Eagle Picks. You see that pick right in front of you there, Rich? Those oh, yeah. customized Eagle Picks for you? When, when I, I play, play the, the bass... bass. This, this is, is this is the pick I use. For just sure. just don't, don't take that home with you. You don't, you don't miss, miss a single, single string, string when your pick's that big. That big. <laughs> uh, that's also, what she said, I feel like there's a, that's what she said there, but I'm not sure. <laughs> she says, or oh, anyone, 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 anyone can, can say, say that. that. <laughs> She says she watched this video last night. Oh, this is a few few songs ago. Everybody, Rich has a lot of videos on YouTube. Make sure you go check them out. There's hundreds of thousands of views, tons of exciting videos. Make sure you check them out. I'm not sure which one she's referring to. Mike Pratt has an amazing question here, though, for Rich. Who would win in a fight between a taco and a grilled cheese sandwich? Ooh, are we talking hard taco or soft taco? Hold on. That's Hold like, on. Are, are we able to get a real-time update in this? We have Mike right here. Hard oh, or soft oh, taco? In the room. Hard taco, prison rules. Ooh. I'm going hard taco. Wow. Yeah, sorry, grilled cheese. How will, how will hard taco win the fight? Uh, I think they just will simply, simply like outlast the grilled cheese, which gets disgusting after like 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Nathan Pylon has a real question for you. Did you add some more drums to the beats for the middle? Uh, that did. question is really driven. Who, sorry, who asked that? Uh, that was Nathan Pylon. Oh, Nathan. Hello, and Nathan. he says, love you, bud. Yeah, I love you too. Um, yeah, I did. I did. Uh, it should be the same as the last time. He's also a band member. Uh, should be the same as the last time we played together. But wait a minute. When did we play together last? Because you were doing, he was doing a David Bowie uh, tribute show the last time we might have played. Oh, no, no, it'll be the same as when we played on the waterfront. There we go. Figured it out, brain. <laughs> that was that was high quality entertainment. That was riveting. Yeah, just everybody in the room and at home just are just in there. Just churning. No one's privy to what's going on. Just <laughs> just a guy mumbling. We're in a death shirt. Don't worry, we're just gonna edit all of this out anyway. Oh, oh wait, yeah, we're gonna fix it in post. We're gonna add a click here. I'm gonna say everything really funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna let over your lips. We're just gonna like put something in there. Uh, all Sharon my Henderson. Comedians. Yeah. <laughs> Sharon Henderson says, "Dude, you're growing on me. I do like your sound." Thank uh, you. And uh, Roger Laborian says, "Great tunes, guys. I I'll have to pop in and play." Who's Roger Laborian? We're just not gonna pop let you come play. here and play, Roger. We'll pop in and play. Maybe we should let him pop in and play. Roger, just come here. <laughs> I I think I see him waiting across the street there, and he's just yeah. like, "What's up? <laughs> Is this time now?" Anyway, everybody he's got drumsticks in his hand. No drums. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Play, play there and there, uh, everywhere. <laughs> Everywhere, anybody, everybody, we're gonna get back to more music. Please click like, please click share. Let's get it to over 100 shares for the night. Show some love for Rich O'Coin and go check him out at the Goodwill tomorrow. Anyway, take it away. Sweet, thanks. Uh, well, this next one, I normally play under a huge parachute. So here is the only version of me performing it at a keyboard to a seated room that will ever happen. <laughs> From the standpoint of the self, time is completely relative. You can have, if you scale it down, as much time between two of those very rapid drum beats as you can in eons and eons and eons.
Give it up for Rich O'Coin, all the way here from Halifax, Nova Scotia. We still have more songs to go, so don't go anywhere just yet. And if you haven't heard me say it enough, I'm going to say it one more time. Please click like and please click share. We're going to give away three pairs of tickets to a show tomorrow night at the Goodwill Social Club, put on by Real Love. Also, shout out to those guys for putting on that show with Sophie Stevens Band, and it's also with Sports Club, a couple crowd favorites here in Winnipeg. Tim Green says, thank you. This is great. And uh, Roger Liborian says he's going to play some mean blues harmonica. Yeah, so I guess get over here. I see you're just standing across the street. Come yeah. on. Come on down. Get in here. Jam on the next song. It's all in G. He it could... never changes. The next song, watch his left hand. G, is it going to move from it? Nope. You're going to maybe, maybe a C? Nope. Nope. Just G. <laughs> and uh, tell us, uh, you Bring have your a G harmonica is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> You have, a, you have a few more shows on your tour. Tell us uh, where those are so maybe people from out of town can go watch them. Yeah, I have two left after Winnipeg uh, in the wonderful province of Alberta in Edmonton, uh, City of Champions, and Seatown in Calgary. And are you uh, taking your bike or are you a uh, driver uh, flying No this bike. One? A little too cold for the bike. <laughs> uh, kind of freezing today. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, uh, just, we'll get there. <laughs> right on. Anyway, we have a few more songs still come from Rich O'Coin. We're not going anywhere just yet, everybody at home. So everybody, give it up for Rich O'Coin. All right, so this is the one that's normally under a parachute. This is a one-time performance of it on a keyboard to a room of seated people. Here we go. But if, but you, if you want, want to yell along, this, this heart, heart is, is all that keeps us up. up. This, this heart, heart is beating. Is beating. Do that, that too. too. And, and the bridges, the bridges when, you when you give it, it all, all, you get it back. back.
And everybody, if you want to see that with a parachute tomorrow, go to the Goodwill Social Club. And you know what, Rich? Everybody at home doesn't want to hear me talk. We just want to hear you keep doing your thing. Tell the world whatever you want to tell, but play some more tunes. Take it away, man. Maybe this is my last everybody song wants well. to tell us is, that a time I is the difference between ourselves and the rest of the world. So my image of me is not at all your image. And my image of me is extremely incomplete.
Guess what? We can't let you be done just there. Did you say that was your last song? Does everybody in the room want one more song? Does everybody in the room want two more songs? All right, everybody, thank you so much for joining us. We are the Village Idiots. This is live at the Roslyn. We do this every single week at 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. This is Rich O'Coin. We've had such an amazing night. And next week, we have Urban Artist of the Year at the Western Canadian Music Awards Low, and it's going to be amazing. And uh, the encore, as always, is brought to you by Quest Music. Those guys are proud supporters of Winnipeg Music. And if you're going to do anything, support local. Come on, everybody. We're all about local, but this week, we're all about Halifax with Rich O'Coin. But anyway... We'll see you uh, next week, of course, but here's two more songs by Rich O'Coin. Thanks, everyone. But you understand, you give up your dream, you die. Uh, this, uh, this one's called, called it. it. If you want to yell, yell, we won't leave this on our heads. Uh, here we go. Yeah.
Thanks a lot. Uh, is that is that is that it? Or are we 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 oh we are gonna do that. Okay, cool. I thought you were just like yeah another one, but like <laughs> no, but we're cool. That's that thing we should end with there. Okay, uh, yeah. Thanks so much for having me. Uh, I'm playing uh, tomorrow at the Goodwill. We did all that. We talked to new album. I introduced myself, and we're gonna play. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be interesting, because now I'm gonna end with a with a six minute instrumental. So <laughs> get what you wished for. Here you go. Here's the encore. Here we go. If you wanna have this nice and dark and moody, that'd be sweet.
much. Everybody, that was Rich O'Coin live at the Roslyn. Rich, you gonna you pretty pumped for the Goodwill show tomorrow? Yeah, thanks so much. Everybody, we're gonna give away three pairs of tickets to people who shared that video and clicked like for Mike Osakoya, for Kevin Moretz, for Joey Senf, Atom Shaman, Kevin Ripe, Derek Benjamin. My name is Riley Saunders. You've been watching Rich O'Coin live at the Roslyn. We'll see you next week.